subscribe and leave a comment to see your face in the next video. Talking of all you perverts, it was a big year. It was a big year for paedophile movies. Um, surviving R. Kelly, Leaving Neverland, Two Popes. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. I don't care. I don't care. Ready? Ready? Yeah. Tell me when. <laughs> well, you got to get it straight away. Okay. Ready? Tell me when. Tell me when. What are you seeing when my tongue's out? <laughs> you were saying now. Now. <laughs> are you recording? Not a foregone conclusion. In spite of these scores you see here, we'll get rid of those scores right now. We will, of course, add them to whatever the... Hey, Brad's score is still on there. <laughs> Many talented people of colour were snubbed in major categories. Um, unfortunately, there's nothing we can do about that. The Hollywood foreign press are all very, very racist. So, <laughs> fifth time. So. No, no, we've got to drag it out for three hours. You could binge watch the entire first season of Afterlife instead of watching this show. That, that's a show about a man who wants to kill himself because his wife dies of cancer. And it's still more fun than this, okay? <laughs> Spoiler alert, um, season two is on the way, so in the end, he obviously didn't kill himself. Just like Jeffrey Epstein. <laughs> Shut up. I know he's your friend, but I don't care. You have to make your own way here in your own plane. Not Italia. I don't think these guys know that this is a Libyan postcard. They're heading straight back to Libya. They snuck snuck into the room to see what the... I sneaked into the room. Snuck isn't a word, Conan. And you went to Harvard and you should know that. Snuck. Past and past part of sneak. <laughs> <laughs> Martin Scorsese, the greatest living director, made the news for his controversial comments about the Marvel franchise. He said they're not real cinema and uh, they remind him of theme parks. I agree. Although I don't know what he's doing hanging around theme parks. He's not big enough to go on the rides, is he? <laughs> it's tiny. <laughs> right. For over a decade. But recently, they found that controversy has come home to roost in their very own backyard. An infestation of Canadian brown finches, which is a small part... <laughs> I guess I should have seen that one coming, huh?
the Irishman was amazing. It was amazing. Um, that, it was. My, my, it was great. Uh, long, but amazing. Um, it wasn't the only epic movie. Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, nearly three hours long, Leonardo DiCaprio attended the premiere, and by the end, his date was too old for him. So... <laughs> Okay, we about to go on vacation. Where are we going? More money, more... Hey, Melbourne. How's it going? You good? Sweet. Sweet. Uh, this is my confetti cannon. <laughs> I know, right? Uh, this is the button that sets it off. And um, it's very exciting. And... Uh, um, uh, you seem like a nice man. Um, just, I'm going to give this to you, mate. Just set it off when you think's the right time in the set, yeah? One minute, 37 seconds later. My, uh, it's actually really lovely, my family at the moment. We've got a lot closer because my mum recently passed away. Right, um... The world got to see James Corden as a fat pussy. <laughs> he was also in the movie Cats, but no one saw that. Um, and the reviews, oh, shocking. I saw one that said, this is the worst thing to happen to cats since dogs, right? <laughs> but Dame Judi Dench defended the film, saying it was the role she was born to play, because she... I can't do this next joke. <laughs> because she loves nothing better than plonking herself down on the carpet, lifting her leg and licking her <laughs> Furball, furball. She's old school. Um, I sat here and posed for like 10 minutes. Let me see the product. Is that me? for senior photos, okay? Oh, what was daddy like? Daddy don't know what he's doing anyway. That's how you say that's that's a great drawing in French. statue is round. Name three other things that are round. The earth. Um, my balls.
This just in, police uh, officers in Lancaster, Pennsylvania, were asking people to be on the lookout for a man who robbed a store. And I think, yeah, I think we do, we do have his description. Can we take that? Let's take his description. Okay. This is the guy uh, they, wanted, they wanted people in Pennsylvania to be out on the lookout for. He's got, uh, well, he's got a nose and some hair. That goes like that, and he was uh, he was wearing a hat at the time of this particular particular crime. He's got kind of a chin that comes down to a almost a point. 